Hello, little ones. Welcome to our fun-filled farm adventure. I'm Kay, and I'm here to take you on an exciting journey through the wonderful world of farm animals. Together, we'll meet friendly cows, oinking pigs, clucking chickens, and so much more. We'll learn their names, the sounds they make, and the role they play on the farm. Get ready to discover the magic of the farm with me. So gather around and let's start our incredible farm animal learning adventure. Are you ready? Make sure you have on your thinking caps. This is gonna be fun. We're gonna learn all about farm animals. In a cozy little farm nestled at the heart of the countryside, there lived a curious little toddler named Timmy. Timmy loved to explore the world around him, but what Timmy loved most were all the farm animals that called his family farm their home. One sunny morning as the roosters crowed, Timmy's adventures began. He crawled out of his bed, put on his tiny green boots, and headed to the barn with his mom. We're going to meet some new friends today, his mom said with a smile. As they approached the barn, a gentle moo echoed through the air. Timmy's eyes grew wide with excitement as he followed the sound. Moo, moo, he echoed back. Inside the barn, they found Daisy the cow, a bit gentle creature with soft brown eyes and a swishy tail. Timmy patted her velvety nose and giggled as she licked his hand. Moo, Timmy said. Cows live on the farm and provide us with milk, which is used to make dairy products like cheese, butter, yogurt, and ice cream. Next, they headed to the chicken coop where a clucking chorus filled the air. Timmy watched in amazement as his mom collected fresh eggs. Cluck, cluck, he said. Inside the coop, they met Henrietta the hen and her fluffy chicks. Timmy carefully held one of the fuzzy baby chicks in his hands. He whispered, cluck, cluck, as if sharing a secret. Chickens are kept either for their meat or to lay eggs. Female chickens lay eggs and they are known as hens. They tend to lay one to two eggs each day. A male chicken is called a rooster and they're responsible for the cockadoodle doos. Their adventure continued as they strolled over to the pasture where a group of woolly sheep grazed. Timmy's mom handed him a handful of grass to feed the sheep. Timmy reached out with a big grin and said, bye, bye, as the sheep nibbled the grass from his hand. Sheep provide us with wool, leather, milk, and meat. There are over 1,000 breed of sheep. In the pig pen, Timmy discovered a group of playful piglets. Their oinks and squeals filled the air and Timmy couldn't help but to join the fun. Oink, oink, he squealed as the piglets wiggled their pink noses. Pigs are reared on the farm for their meat. We get pork, bacon, and sausages from pigs. The day went by in a blur of laughter and animal sounds. Timmy met goats that bleated. Goats are also commonly found on farms. They can be milked just like cows can, and their milk can be used to make cheese, butter, yogurt, and even soap. As they moved along, they even saw ducks that quacked. Ducks are intelligent, friendly individuals who love spending their time relaxing on the water or foraging for food. They are super social animals. They even met a friendly horse that need a greeting. Each encounter was a new adventure and Timmy soaked up every moment. Horses also live on the farm and help the farmer with their day-to-day -day work. As the sun began to set, Timmy and his mom made their way back to the farmhouse where a warm dinner awaited them. Timmy's heart was so full of joy as he remembered all the farm animal friends he had met that day. Great job everyone. That is all. I hope you had fun learning all the farm animals. Give yourselves a round of applause. You did fantastic. I'm so proud of you. Great job. And remember, Every day is a new day to learn something new. Thank you so much for joining us on our learning adventure today. If you had fun and learned something new, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and ring the notification bell so you'll never miss our next exciting lessons. Until next time, see you soon.